What's up guys? For today's watch review we're going to be talking about the Armatron Instalite. Let's do a quick 360 and go right into the talking points. So starting off with price, this is a very budget friendly watch. I bought this on a military base so I didn't pay sales tax but MSRP is $20 and you're looking out the door probably around 23 so still very budget friendly and is this watch tactical, schmactical, dressy or casual? I will say definitely casual and it, I think it could be tactical um, it's a very rugged and durable watch so it'll survive most environments it doesn't have that many features but it is reliable so I say it fall under tactical um, for functions very minimal basically what you've got is date and alarm so you hit the date button it tells you what day it is and the alarm which tells you what time your alarm is set to which mine is not set to anything and then this mode button right here takes you to the stopwatch and that's it so date alarm and stopwatch some people might think that's a bad thing I absolutely love the fact that there is only really one mode all right going on to the next item illumination let me go ahead and turn off the lights illumination on this watch is fantastic you've got a very pleasant turquoise or teal backlight and a even more pleasant fading like I've never seen that on a cheap digital watch before I don't know if that's like normally a premium feature, but I thought it was cool considering that this is only a $20 watch. Right, going on to the next item, visibility. Visibility is 10 out of 10. As you can see, it's got that shiny green face. Um, I don't know if that helps, but to me, in my opinion, I think it helps a lot with visibility in the sun and in dimly lit rooms but absolutely no issues with seeing the time at any angle at any level of light next item is button and crown placement so button placement is excellent they're very well protected so you'll never accidentally depress any of these buttons um, and you'll never accidentally depress them with the back of your hand in fact, they might be a little bit too well protected because you can't just easily press them with the um, wide part of your fingertip. You really have to use the top part of your fingertip to get in there. <clears throat> All right, next item, band quality and comfort. So this is not the original band. The original band is this cheap nylon Velcro strap, which there's nothing wrong with it. It works perfectly fine and it's very comfortable, breathes well. I just didn't like it. I felt like it looked childish and cheap. So I got rid of it and I swapped it out for this natal band, which cost me about $12 on Amazon. So this whole package out the door was about 35 bucks. So still very economical and budget friendly. <clears throat> All right, last item is overall and should you buy? Yes, you should buy this watch. There's nothing about it that I can complain about. Um, you know, some people might complain that it's only got a, it's really only got a stopwatch. But to me, that's a good thing. To me, that's um, something, one less thing that I got to remember how to use. You know, this watch, all I got to remember is that it's got a start and stop button for the stopwatch, and that's it. No special sequence of pushing buttons to utilize some high tech feature. Um, granted, there's nothing wrong with a fancy watch, but there's also nothing wrong with a very simple watch either. Um, as far as looks go, you know, this, this isn't going to turn any heads, really. But something about its humble appearance really appeals to me. Um, also, the fact that it's very reminiscent of retro 80s style digital watches really gets me going. It's something I really like. So, yeah, if you were on the fence, or if you just see this in passing, you know, I say get it. It's a fun little watch. One that you won't be upset if you lost or broke or whatever. But also one that would be fun to take care of. And you can you know, keep it as a little piece of history. 
So that's really all I got to say. Uh, I hope that this video helps you with your next watch purchase. Thank you for watching and tune in for my next episode. All right, bye.